if everyone, myself included, can do that after I make this video, we may have a chance to, for a lot of people to not get scammed. In a world full of Yu-Gi-Oh cards, grading, selling, buying, one card game remains supreme. One man has the insights you need to know. Watch and subscribe now. Yu-Gi-Oh! Tube. What's up, YouTube? Yu-Gi-Oh! Tube with more disappointing news here this morning. It is 2.50 a.m. Somehow I'm still up, and uh, what do I see? A bunch of auctions ending in October throughout the whole month. $2,000 for these boxes. Yeah, you'd think Legend of Blue Eyes first at LOB for 2 k a steal, right? Absolutely not. These are all fake boxes. All these boxes that you see running down the screen, all fake, not real, not authentic, purely counterfeit boxes from Croatia, Republic of Croatia. And right now, what do we see here? A Metal Raiders box, huh? Really? Metal Raiders box, another fake. How do you know it's fake? You could clearly tell from the discoloration. It is an absolute monstrosity. Again, it, the saturation of this box is horrific. You could see uh, with the wrapping, the wrapping was really not clear like that. Uh, it, there's so much wrong with this. You know, the Konami logo, I believe, also is wrong. Uh, the A and M look very spaced out. Watch out for that, too. Um, but overall, look at the discoloration here, folks. I mean, you can't be fooled. $300, no bids, thank God. This one from uh, Zay... I don't even know what this is. Zaydar. Zaydar? One feedback on this guy. The other guy has 136 feedbacks. Here's a first dead, uh, Legacy of Darkness. This is, a, again, a fake. A bunch of nonsense. Uh, the IPC, that's a different font, I believe. I could be wrong, but look at this. Like, all the shadows here, the font. Look at how this is wrapped. A disaster. But the big thing, and even the wrapping, it's not reflective like that. Uh, look at the saturation. Saturation tells it all, folks. Uh, a lot of people selling fake counterfeit stuff. Look at the saturation here on Blue Eyes, White Dragon boxes. What a disaster. Look at the, look at the wrapping on that. My God goodness oh a nice little stain too someone took a poopy on the bottom of the box or maybe even peed i don't know we're in the subways of newark so uh yeah basically uh labyrinth of nightmare first edition look at this again yugi looks like he was sunning for about three to five days pretty consistently got burnt and it turned into that nice golden brown skin right and uh yeah this is yet another disaster yeah Last Warrior from Another Planet also, I guess, joined Yugi at the beach, right? Uh, avoid $560. Uh, what do we got? Look at this. I mean, they, you're, you got to be looking at this and saying these are not real boxes. That's that's just a monstrosity. Um, more blue eyes. And these are just a bunch of crap. Um, I'm interested to see the first edition logos on these. Um, it's hard to really see. They're kind of blurry. Um, it looks almost like a wavy print font, or maybe a maybe maybe a maybe a glossy print font. Um, it's a tough call, but there it's shifted on, on the other side. And just just a disaster again. It, it's just very hard to see. Um, let's see. If there's any more here, or was that all? Hopefully that's all because this is a bunch of nonsense. Everybody, please, call to action. Please message these sellers and say, hey, these are all counterfeit. This one right here, Rafa Croatia. And in this one right here, currently, kneecap 96. Okay. Message these sellers, please, and just say these are not real counterfeit boxes. They are counterfeit absolutely 100%. I'd like you to list them that way. If everyone, myself included, can do that after I make this video, we may have a chance to for a lot of people to not get scammed because a lot of people paying $560, $1,300, $1,200 for all these fake boxes. This is crazy. I've gotten messages on eBay asking me if these are real or fake boxes. A few, and that's what prompted me to make this video. 
everybody message these sellers right now and tell them to revise their listings and mark them as fake, counterfeit, and not authentic. Tell the buyers that bought these items that they are not real. They're a bunch of uh, scam. It, it's an absolute disaster. Uh, so, so again, please do that. Um, and that way we can at least have this call to action to kind of get this going. And if the seller refuses to do so, then we should all look into possibly this button right here reporting the item. I think that might be worth it if the if the seller says I don't know, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. We all know it's not real. If the if the seller refuses to acknowledge that, maybe we all have to again come together and report the item or report the seller or both. Okay? Because people can't be scammed thousands upon thousands of dollars. It is an absolute nightmare. And there is one currently on auction. So, all right. Hope this helps. Until next time, avoid these at all costs. And please, if you have any time, please do send that message to the seller and see what they say. Until next time, Yu-Gi-Oh! Tube, signing out.